I am Admiral Akbar of the Republic Fleet. Today we are learning the alphabet using Star Wars. If you are wondering how, then look onto the board. If you want to learn the alphabet, then you rather do it with Star Wars. A stands for Aquilish. Aquilish was an underwater species from the planet Andra, just like my world. I am a Mon Calamari from the planet Mon Cala. B stands for Bomar Monks. The Bomar Monks were an order of spider-like beings who carried their own brains in jars near their own body. C stands for Chairman. Masamido was the Chairman of the Galactic Republic and the right-hand man of Chancellor Palpatine. D stands for the Daughter. The Daughter was a physical embodiment of the light side of the Force. E stands for the Electrostaff. The Electrostaff was the weapon that the Magna Gods of General Grievous used. It was kind of an electric staff. F stands for the First Order. The First Order was an organization that rose from the ashes of the Empire and continued in evil doings. G stands for Gondark. The Gondark were a scary alien species from the planet Vancor. H stands for Holograms. Holograms were sort of a Star Wars version of Skype. Holograms only showed you in blue color and showed you your full size without any of the background included. I stands for Iridonia. Iridonia was a planet in the galaxy. Natives to Iridonia were Iridonian Zabrax. J stands for Jabba the Selegic Teure. Jabba the Selegic Teure, also known as Jabba the Hutt, was a crime lord from the planet of Tatooine. K stands for Kirak and Phila. Kirak and Phila was a Jedi who survived Order 66 and later fought Darth Vader on the river moon of Al Dolim. L stands for Leku. The Leku were hair like tentacles that came off a twilight sword to Gruta's head. M stands for Minox. The Minox were space parasites that lived inside asteroids and space slugs and liked to chew onto parts of different ships. N stands for Night Sisters. The Night Sisters were a clan of four sensitive witches that came from the planet of Daphomir. O stands for OPC Killer. The OPC Killer was a giant fish that swam in the dumps of the Nabu Seas and was a scary fish. P stands for Padawan. Padawans were basically the apprentices of a Jedi or Sith. Well, usually Jedi, like Obi-Wan Kenobi and uh, Anakin Skywalker. Eventually, if a Jedi becomes like a Jedi Knight, his kind of hair thing is cut down because he is no longer a Padawan. And now that he is a Jedi Knight, he can finally cut off his hair thing. I don't know how that's called, and I did not research that because I'm a fish. Q stands for Quarren. Oh, the Quarren. You know, there was a war between us and the... Because my species, the Bon Calamari, had a war with the Quarren. And, uh, oh, what a war that was. Uh, I, uh, so, I'm getting off topic. Warren was our second race on the planet of Moncala. There was us, Moncala Murray, and then there was Quarren. There's not much to say about it. Just that. R stands for Rapper Tooney. Rapper Tooney was a musician in the Max Rebo band and performed uh, to Jabba on his musical instruments. S stands for Salukamai. Salukamai was an exotic and unusual planet that appeared during the Clone Wars. T stands for Tanti V4. Tanti V4 was a ship of the rebellion that was crucial to the war. It belonged to Senator Bail Organa and later to his daughter Leia Organa and also to Captain Antilles until he got choked. U stands for Ugnats. Ugnats were little pig like beings who worked on Cloud City and were basically service people. V stands for Valeria. Valeria was a whippet crime lord who was basically trying to kill Jabba the Hutt. Double U stands for Watto. Watto was a junk dealer from the planet of Tatooine. X stands for Xanatos. 
Xanatos was Qui-Gon Jinn's first Padawan, who joined the dark side and became evil. Y stands for Yaddo. Yaddo was a Jedi Master, the same species as Master Yoda. She sat on the Jedi Council in Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. Z stands for Zero Beast. The Zero Beast was a huge creature from Alistair that lived inside its core. Oh, Mr. Eggburn, hello, how are you? Uh, so, I can hear because, you know, you need to get off the stage. I'm, I'm gonna uh, do my alphabet with you, the Star Wars alphabet. Remember, I think I left the drafts here somewhere. Um, uh, uh, about that. What? It's, it's kind of like, uh, the problem is I, I already yes. did it. I already did it. You already... What? You already did it instead of me? I was supposed to be the guy who was in the video, not you, Mr. Eichbar. You're a fish. You're a talking fish. And That's I'm racist. racist. I'm sorry. That was a little racist indeed. Okay. I really do hope that you specified that rapper Tooney's instrument was a groundy harmonic. You did? Didn't you? Um, nope. Oh, and surely for all you said over and sisters. Um, no, I didn't. Come on, Mr. Ragbar. This was supposed to be the whole joke. O is over and sisters, and that's me. And you've ruined it. Come on, Ragbar. You're... But sir, if I said that sentence, nothing would make sense. Because I'm not over and sisters, you are. And then nobody would understand the joke. So it's good that I didn't say it. Well, you're right in that. Um, oh, and the last thing, surely you cared enough to research that the Padawan thing was the hair braid. Ah, uh, no. You didn't do that. How, how, how is this supposed to be in my kind of video where you didn't do any research and you don't know anything? <sighs> Mr. Agba. Next time, I will not allow you to sneak onto the studio to eat some fish or whatever you're eating. Fish chips. Thank you for watching. Now, if you want to see more of my talking fish friend, that, or of me, of me, you better subscribe to the channel, Oprah and Sissies.